Well, it was a grease blockage that led to 432,000 gallons of sewage to overflow into an Arlington Creek. Yikes. Yeah, according to our news partners at the Florida Times Union, much of that sewage is thought to have entered Jones Creek before going out into the St. Johns River. Double yikes. JA is now testing water samples from the creek to track the spill. The original block in the pipeline is thought to be made up of grease and non-disposable items that have been flushed down the sewer line. A JA spokesperson told the Florida Times Union that the blockage may have been causing that overflow since November 2nd. A reminder not to put any grease or fatty items uh, down your drains. Dispose of them properly or else you could get something like this happening.